be runs and that will be four of them just given a little bit of width and that was all he needed onto it very quickly and so far good one four to six superb shot and that's going to go all the way for six runs indicated by Venkat really lashed onto that really that's tremendous footwork he's picked the short delivery from Kumble very quickly and uh, good footwork right across with that back foot of his and he's given it a real thump really tweaking the ball and uh, troubling the batsman so if he can uh, drop that ball on one of the bare patches then uh, maybe he can get some turn that's delicately touched cut away for four runs delightful shots there But he latched onto them very well and that might just go over the ropes of four runs. That's uh, slightly short pitched and uh, very quickly onto that, timing it to perfection and just wide of the fielder. And that's the 50 for Michael Bevan. Australian Lingo. That's well, well hit. He just threaded that between that short third man and backward point. There really was not much of a gap. Guided down towards the boundary, beats the fielder, and once more goes for four. We haven't seen any real big shots. Thank you, Tony. Sachin Tendulkar continuing. And he's pulled that, and once again, he's hit it in the gap. Good. And once again, he's played that shot. Second time he's done that. And this time, he's cleared the boundary quite comfortably. Here in Dhaka. A mighty blow and no doubt about that one and that's an impressive way to bring up his hundred what a wonderful way to do it Michael Bevan he might not be going to be on the winning side who knows but it certainly is a very very fine performance by Michael Bevan 88 balls in the air but it's going to drop safely and it's against the rope now did he save that i just wonder whether we need to have another little look at that razak certainly didn't know that whether he had put his foot on the rope or not well i think the rest of the world need all the runs they can get and uh, they certainly don't want to lose any in that manner I know Kumble doesn't look too happy with that. Catch it! In the air, cries of catch it. And he's dropped it and he's knocked it over the boundary. Well, Sarah Ganguly. Not... He's giving him another chance. No, he's not. No, he's not. That's a chance for somebody in the crowd. This is absolutely brilliant batting. This one was flighted by Anil Kumble. How quickly it was picked by Bevan. Look at that elevation. Beautifully timed. Still middling it, still going with the effort. It's flipped away into space. It's going to be four. Aravinda da Silva not bothering to chase it. Right there you see once again winding up over to the top four that. runs. And that's clubbed straight down the ground. That's a remarkable hit. He moves up to 150, having got to 100 with a six. He now gets to another landmark with a six. Tremendous innings here by Michael Bevan. Well, it's not an official one-day international, but goodness me, it's got to be one of the best one-day international games you'll ever see amongst the top-class players. And the top-class players, as he has another smash to the leg side. He just hasn't had anyone that's been able to stay with him long enough, but absolutely brilliant. And you almost, in the rest of the world, 11 and needing nearly 13, 12 and a half, 13 to the over, and you almost think 
they still got a chance while well, he's at the crease. He's just uh, a cool customer. What a player. Prince in one day internationals. And he's just beaten the field every single time. This is quite exceptional batting. Absolutely amazing. Really one of the top uh, innings that I've seen in one day. Top edge down towards the boundary. It goes all the way for four. That's the kind of boundary they're looking for. They don't mind where they come from now. And in fact, Bevan has realized that boundaries are needed. Down towards the extra cover boundary, goes for another four. Remarkable batting. Finding the gap, striking the ball well enough, reduces the target to 20 off the last over. 301 for seven. And the match has gone right down to the wire. Magnificent strike down the ground. We've seen that shot before. This one didn't quite carry. It goes absolutely straight. And that's one of those boundaries. The force is with Michael Bevan. Four balls to go. He's gone again. Another four. Reduction now to 11 from three deliveries. And the crowd, as much as they appreciate the good shots, they're not sure better they, what they should cheer. 176 not out. Can he possibly win this game? 11 runs, three balls. He can possibly win it. That's another four. Now he's reduced it to seven from just two deliveries. He needs two more fours. And Abdul Razak, at the age of 20, now realizes what it is to be under pressure before 65,000 people to win this game. They'll have to go for two, which they will. So that's going to be six off the last ball. And uh, I'm afraid. Well, let's have a look at this. Third umpire calling the play. It's a tight one. I think Carrick knows he's gone. I think the, the, the Asian players know he's gone. It brings Bevan back onto the strike. The match has come down to this. One ball, a six will do it. Michael Bevan faces Abdul Razak. And not quite. He's got the four. They win by one run. And just spare a thought for Michael Bevan. 185 not out. As fine an innings as you will ever see the level of the game so Asia win by one run and we've got a match because of this man